I have to pay attention. A lot of times I forget or screw up things on this walk back. But not today. For some reason, visceraling these guys always gives you a very glorious blood splatter, so... I mean, you tend to be covered in blood in this game anyway, but... Nice, faster way to get there. If I was in the League, Valtteri's summon sign would be here, but since I'm not in the League presently, it is not. And we might not even have the good optimal rune. Like the Hunter's Rune for Stamina Recovery. Not that it matters that much. Yeah. So if I'm on point, this will take like three or four tries. Maybe just one. If I'm not on point, then who knows. <laughs> I have to pay a lot of attention. There is, of course, the potential for being invaded here, and it doesn't matter at all because I'll just enter the boss arena before the invader shows up. So basically, just wasted his time doing nothing for reasons unclear. Backdash. It's always at the front. I was really expecting a slow slice there, we didn't do it. There's one. Too late. Need to stagger it and get one. Uh, if Henriette dies, I will quit. You know, bother fighting him. But we can stagger him and run off. Okay. It's been a while since Henry has died, but there's always potential for that. And now we just use the Hunter's Mark. And use the terrain to our advantage, so we can't get to this. <clears throat> Timing was a little off on the slow dodge, or maybe I just dodged in the wrong direction. If you dodge a little bit diagonally to the left and forward. I think that's safer than dodging diagonally to the right, as I did. That's probably why I got hit. I think the timing was okay. But we had the bad AIRNG. -A that's what killed us. Alright, we have a uh, higher potential for being invaded here because I screwed up. And forgot to kill this patrol on the way over here, so... It's probably not going to matter, like I'm still going to be able to engage the boss, but I might have to hurt out again.
So Henriette took some damage from the big dude because I fucked up, so that increases her chance of dying and lowers her blood vial count. I believe they have five blood vials, the NPCs do, so... If you pay attention to her health recovery, you can sort of tell when they won't be able to heal anymore. Pretty seldom the backdash doesn't hit. So it's interesting that it did. 3 4, okay. Alright, looks like bad RNG again, and this one right heals. Oh, got lucky that it turned out. And died to backdash, okay. Backdash is one of his two bullshit attacks, the other one is what he did dress there, the retard stops. Both of them are virtually unavoidable, but, uh, and apart from being unavoidable, they can't be punished, so they're, like, useless on two levels. <laughs> they, they won't one-shot you, so they're not that bad, but they're, um, just badly designed, I don't know. Bloodstar Blood Beast doesn't attack like that, where you, that's very easy to avoid, or almost impossible not to avoid. But all that attack does is make him move halfway across the map, and then he can do it again and again. And all it does is waste your time. So same concept there, except with Ludwig it's sort of like a soft and rage timer of whenever Henriette dies. So, which is about, like, let's say 70 seconds into the fight, approximately. With some variance. Just some potential I might get a phone call today, we'll see. It, it usually really, really aggravates me when it happens, but... <laughs> like, you, you wonder why I'm so irrationally angry at getting a phone call. Well, it's because I'm busy. And not is more annoying than phone calls. Or other human beings, of course. The My beloved misanthropy. Oh, uh, let's see here. That's not really true, uh, but there's just specific moments or specific things that irritate me. Yeah, that's be forward on the left and fucking up the angle. That's why the dive is not working. I don't know why. I had to fight under a little bit. I forgot. It's just a little tilt to the analog stick. Okay, we finally got a stagger in a situation where we can do damage. And then he went straight for retard stamps. Wonderful. Henriette was nice enough to knock him out of it. Now she has low health. Which is a problem. And we have a second stagger, which means we'll be very close to uh, the next part of the fight. Oh shit. Okay, we got really, really lucky there. What happened was he did the... Okay. Oh. I'll talk during the cutscene. What happened was he did the slow jump. But Henriette knocked him out of that as well. He staggered when he was doing the slow jump animation, so it never happened. And immediately after that he did the charge. If I did not have both HP runes on, the charge would have one-shot me no matter what.
guiding moonlight. Ooh, like it, man. Very, very lucky. Great, I'm lucky that I didn't turn on Henry. Henry is out of blood levels, so that's a problem. However, he is close to the death point, so it doesn't really matter. Yeah, he's gonna. He's gonna do his big uh, two handed shit at this right here. As long as we avoid it, doesn't matter. Actually, I might have botched this a little bit, but no. Ah, never mind, we got it. There we go. No more Ludwig. 11,513. Barely one fourth of the boss's life bar. Hmm. And somehow his head flew over here. Of his misery, pick up our shiny sword. One of my favorite weapons, actually, even though I despise the Holy Blade. The Moonlight Sword is a pretty fun one, just because the L2 is so damn good. And now we have to go regen, so let's go do that.